In this video, we are discussing about Thales organization in Udagonium. Systematic position of the genus Udagonium. Phylum Chlorophyta, class Chlorophyceae, order Udagoniales, family Udagoniaceae. The class Chlorophyceae is known as green algae, hence Udagonium is a green algae. Thales organization in Udagonium. Udagonium is filamentous, unbranched, freshwater green algae attached to the substratum by means of holdfast. The filament or thallus of Udagonium has three different types of cell. First is the epical cell which is round and small in nature and chlorophyllated. The cells in the middle is known as middle cell which is cylindrical and longer than broad and tapering towards the end and chlorophyllated. The cell of the base is modified into finger like projection and known as Hold fast. It helps in the attachment of Udagonium to the substratum. Cell structure of Udagonium. The cell is surrounded by a three-layered cell wall. Cell wall is three-layered and the inner layer is made up of cellulose, middle is made up of pectin and outer made up of chitin. Inside the cytoplasm, there is a reticulate single chloroplast. The chloroplast is single reticulate. Reticulate meaning network lake. And the research food material of chlorophyceae is starched and it is stored in special protein bodies known as pyrenoids. The single nucleus of Udagonium is peripheral or it is not centrally located. Some of the middle cells have epical caps and these cells are known as cap cells. The epical cap is actually the remnants of parent cell wall left behind on one of the doctor cell after cell division. In this picture, you can see pyrenoids which store starch, reticulated network like chloroplast and cap cells with epical cap. As I have already mentioned, epical cap is actually the remnant of parent cell wall left behind one of the doctor cell after cell division and the cells with Epical cap are known as cap cells. In conclusion, thallus of Udagonium is multicellular, chlorophyllated, unbranched filamentous. Features of thallus to be remembered are three layered cell wall, which is made up of cellulose, pectin, and chitin, single peripheral nucleus reticulated chloroplasts and pyrenoids.